Tonight on Toilet Bourbon Challenge, we're doing a Maker's Mark Wood Finish Series Challenge. Welcome back to another Tiller's Bourbon Challenge. Hey, I'm Randy. This is Richard. And tonight we're doing a Maker's Mark Wood Finish Series. Um, this is one that I am looking forward to. Yes. Yeah. Uh, well, in, a re in a recent video that we did, we, we did the Cellar Age. And we talked about this would be a good challenge, and we just had like, all right, we got to do this. Yeah, we got to do Can't it. Stop thinking about it. So this is the uh, Maker's Mark BP from 2023, and this is the Cellar Age from 2023 wood finishing series, and this is the first of the new yeah. wood finishing series for this year. The uh, the hearts, the sorry hearts, the heart release. So yeah, we're gonna try them up. See what we think. And did you notice on the, the side of this, this is uh, one of five. That means volume one of five. E either they're talking about this is going to be one of five of heart release or just one of five of this year's wood wow. finishing. It's they're already August. So, so we're going to have four <laughs> more. Yeah. Uh, at the time of this making this video, it's August. Yeah. Um, yeah. And this is the newest one out that we can get. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. His wife, Katie, poured these up, so we don't know what's in what. So what you got. we're going to be. This is a true blind. Yep. And so uh, we're going to see what we think. Let's just jump right into this. Or well, I'm going to smell them all first. Okay. Start off with clear. Not getting a lot on it. Not getting a lot on that at all. Um, just a hint of uh, oak and a little bit of vanilla, maybe. Yeah. Yeah, not much. Okay. Let's try not a bad smell. It's just not a whole lot there. Let's try purple here. I get a little more sweetness on that. You get a little more sweetness on that. Um, uh, not any oak at all. It's just very faint, though. Yep. Yeah. All right, let's try blue. That's sweetness. Very similar to the pink one. Yeah. Or the purple, or whatever that is. Hmm. They all smell good, but they all smell pretty similar. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. There's really no. I wouldn't pick one over the other as far as the uh, nose and goes. no. Uh, they just kind of smell like Maker's Mark. Yeah. Which is, which is fine. <laughs> yeah. I love Maker's Mark. Yeah. Maker's Mark's one of my favorite distilleries. Yeah. I've got several other different ones back here we can throw um, in if we really wanted to. Yeah. That's probably one in my top four, maybe five distilleries. Maker's Mark. Um, you know, I'd put. Of course, Old Forester up there, Wild Turkey, uh, Buffalo there, Trace, Buffalo Trace, yeah. So Maker's Mark, yeah, it's always one of my good go tos. Oh yeah. So let's uh, go to clear first. Wow. Got a little heat up front, just a little bit on yeah. the tongue. Yeah. But a lot of sweetness. Yep. A lot of sweetness and very smooth. Yeah, it is very smooth. It's uh, I mean, hardly none. No, no burn going down at all. No. Um, a lot of flavor. Mm -hmm. Very flavorful, man. I'm... If that was the only bourbon I had, I'd I'd be very happy. Yes, I wouldn't complain. That's just it. sweet, smooth, and nice. Mellow oak goodness. Yes. It's very good. Oh, man. Mm. Yeah. I don't want to, I want to go to the other ones. <laughs> yeah. I know. Um, I don't know if they could beat that, but so far, that's number one. <laughs> yeah. All right. We'll try our purple out and uh, see if it's well, any different. Wow. A little more oaky right off the top. To me, it is a little murky, um, but it kind of blends right off into some sweetness as well. Yeah, but all the oaks up front, and then it turns into sweetness in yeah. the back palate, That's and then deal. yeah, as right. it goes down with all the oaks on the front. It's good, yeah, but I like the, uh, still like the first one better. Yeah, uh, yeah, I think so too. Yeah. Yeah. But it's close. It's 
Ooh, second sip. Second sip. I'll, I'll go back. We'll to go it. back. To I'll it. go back to it. Um, second sip didn't didn't do me as good as the first one. And I hate when that happens. Uh-huh. All right. I got to do another little palate cleanse. I took a sip off of it, and that was just didn't like that much at all at first sip. Yeah, I mean, do the same thing. I mean, I didn't like. I didn't much. My palate didn't much like that at all. Something, something was weird on that one. I'm gonna try it again. Now I hate when we do these, and it goes in order. Uh, like my favorite, the first one we tried, mm -hmm. second, third, and it makes me think: Is it because we went in that order? Yeah. So I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna you know what, I'm gonna, for a minute. I'm gonna swap these around. Okay. <laughs> and I'm just gonna keep going until I can't even remember what was where. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep on doing this, and then and then go back and rob the line up. Which one is it under? Yeah. And that's that's why we use the color glasses, so even in the end, we'll get it right, you know. Yeah, I think I'm going to go back through again. But like you said, I'm going to switch these first and third ones around. Okay. I'll do the same thing. And, but I'm going to give that a second to let my palate kind of readjust. Right. Because um, for some reason... Even after both sips of that, like for some reason, I don't know why, it's giving me a little skunky taste to it. I don't, yeah, it's weird. It's like it's leaving a, a poor aftertaste. And I, and as I, I hadn't, this is my first try of this. I've tried this before, tried this before, but this is my first try of this. But I don't remember that taste before. Right. Something's weird going on with my palate. I don't know. Yeah, this bottle, by the way, we, we just cracked open. Um, I have had it before. Uh, Vance yeah, opened his bottle, and we, we, we did it one night. Yeah. But um, this one I've had for a while, and it's opened up. This one has actually gotten better. Yeah. Um, from the first time I opened it to uh, a couple months later, trying it again, is really good. Um, and then we've had this at the same time, which you know, this came from – an open bottle. It's a sample we got from our good friend. So, uh, Dave while, I, while I'm sitting here and letting my palate kind of die down a little bit, um, this BEP is 109.6 proof, um, and the uh, cellar age is 115.7 proof, and the heart's desire is 111.7 uh, proof. So they're all those heart release. Those are the heart release. Yeah. yeah. So they're all pretty. High up there in right. proof, um, 110 to 115. So there's not much you can tell when you're tasting them as far as difference in proof. So um, right, really can't distinguish between that. Not on these, but all right, we'll try these again. All right, let's go back through. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go back through. We're gonna go with blue first time on this go through. Okay. That's better. Yeah, it is. Um, I think what it was, I was trying it, them too quickly. Maybe so. And still have it, a it lingering was, flavor from Yeah, that it was overpowering. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, much better that time around. Right. Much, I got that whatever skunkiness I was getting is gone. It's just a good mellow oak with some nice caramel. Chocolate sweetness. Yeah, uh, yeah, I, I'm getting the same thing, and it's complex as well too. There, there's more flavors than that uh, to it. It's, yeah, I was, like about, it, I was about to say the same thing. I'm, I'm getting a different flavor every time I uh, try a little bit of chocolate to it. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah. a little bit of nutmeg almost uh, flavor, like to some it. bacon spices yeah. to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. That was that was very complex. Second time through, right? I'm I'm digging it. I'm digging. I'm glad I gave it a minute. Yes, yes, I'm glad I did too. Um, whatever it is of these three, yeah, they didn't mix well. Yeah, 
So okay. don't so don't don't try no Frankenstein with these. No. It ain't gonna work. No. All right, let's go to this purple again. All right. Okay. Got, got a little oakier that time. Yeah, they did get a little oakier. I was thinking mm -hmm. the same thing. Yep. And I don't know if it's because I just drank water and went straight to it or what, but it's... Uh, no, it's definitely oakier. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Okay. I think that... Okay. I'm just going to keep my, my guess to myself. Yeah, me too. Oh, I just got me a, a floaty. Uh oh. In there. Yeah. Well, hopefully, it? hopefully it wasn't in that. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. All right. Um, it's a bug spray, boy. But it's summertime, so you never know. That is true. Speaking right. of summertime, I don't know if you didn't know. I don't know if you noticed this. I don't know if it's the same thing here. Did you see many June bugs this year? Saw a few, but not alive. Yeah, I saw them belly up. Um, Usually, every year I, I get a ton of them at my house. I might have saw two this year. It's weird. We well, you know how at the beginning of the summer we had the uh, the cicadas. We had two different. Maybe types. they were eating them all up. <laughs> Who knows? But they compete for the same food. Well, oh, that clear was still just as good. I wouldn't put it in first place now. But it's just as good as it was the first time. Yeah, as of right now, uh, mine is blue, clear, and pink. I, I'm with you, hundred percent. And I'm trying to think: should we go keep trying it more, or just stop right there? I'm stopping right there. I'm, I'm not right confusing there. my yeah. palate anymore. Man, um, yep. Uh, let's find what what was what, what, what was what came in third, which was purple. Mm -hmm. Purple is cellar age. Okay. Okay. Which I'm pretty shocked because when we had it, we really liked it. Oh, I'm not saying it's not good. Yeah, I, I'll think, I was thinking you, it may be the winner. <laughs> okay, well, well uh, uh, that's fine. That's uh, it's good. I still enjoy it. Oh, it's still, uh, if I see a bottle of it, I'm going to grab it. We are nitpicking. Yes, right. Yes. Nitpicking. It's like when you got some of the best stuff and you're picking out the best stuff. You know, yeah, uh, you, you got to be a little harsh. Yes. Exactly. To yeah. to pick between. Because you put the you put the same one up against several behind me. It's, it's gonna, gonna win every time. Yeah. Yep. All right. Well, let's see what came in second. Here. Clear. Clear was uh, the heart release. Okay. All right. And which BP. So the BP, which yes. once that sucker opened up. Yes. Uh, like I said, when, I, when we first got it, it was a little. Uh, uh, I wouldn't say the ethanol was strong, but th that was the overall taste of it. All right. But this, the second time I went to that, which was weeks later, weeks later, it was like a totally different bottle. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah. And that has become one of my favorite bottles. Yeah. So I'm not really surprised at that that one. No. Um, and like I said, we just opened this up. So th this may calm down some as well over time. Mm -hmm. we'll, uh, we'll go back and try it again later. Um it was good. They were all they were all great. Yeah, but comparing the three, you got yeah. you got to you got to be nitpicking. Yeah. you got you got to be a little more harsh the uh, credit if you're trying to pick between three excellent I know. choices. And I would so, say these are some of the best makers Mark has. Yes, um, for sure. I, I know. Uh, whenever we've gone through our allocated days, when these were up. These were some of the first ones gone. Every time. Every time. Mm -hmm. um, they, they didn't sit around on the shelf. But, yeah, but that was fun. I'm glad we decided to do this. Oh, yeah, I'm telling yeah. you. Uh, yeah. yeah. We, we, like I said, it came to us when we were doing this video. We thought about it. Why did we do that? Why did we do that? Well, now we got to do it. So we did it. <laughs> that was All fun. Right. So that was fun. Um, that's just our opinion. If yep. you've had these before, comment. Let us know what you think of it. Mm -hmm. And until then, if you haven't subscribed before, don't forget to subscribe. And we'll see you on the next Tiller's Bourbon Challenge. See ya. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, please subscribe, and we'll see you again. Bye.